Welcome to Mojo Travels, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 bike trips in Europe to do with your buddies. Are you a fan of our videos? Be sure to subscribe to Mojo Travels and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos. For this list, we're looking at some of the most beautiful and unique bike trips across Europe. If you're looking for a great outdoor activity with friends, we've got plenty of options for you. Number 10. Black Forest, Germany The birthplace or inspiration of many folktales and fables, Germany's Black Forest has an inherent magic to it. A popular hiking destination, it can equally be explored by bicycle, with a variety of trails to choose from. The most popular, however, is the Southern Black Forest Cycle Route. A roughly 153-mile-long loop, it begins and ends in the beautiful city of Freiburg. The Southern Black Forest Cycle Route is considered to be a five-day trip, and there are a number of comparable routes in the five- to eight-day range. The Black Forest is actually a great bike trip for beginners because it also offers many single-day loop trails, meaning that you can spend every day biking somewhere new without ever having to rough it overnight. Number 9. The Coast of Croatia In recent years, it seems like everyone and their uncle is planning a trip to Croatia. We understand the appeal. This newly trendy destination boasts great weather, picture-perfect beaches, stunning old-world architecture, and an eclectic Mediterranean lifestyle and cuisine. But rather than fight through the crowds of Dubrovnik, why not experience the beauty of Croatia as you navigate the coastline? The journey is often challenging, but it rewards you with a nice variety of views and environments, from breathtaking ocean vistas and islands to verdant forest when the road veers inland. This route will take you through a number of medieval towns and historic villages, allowing you to experience a side of Croatia seen by few travelers. If you're looking for a truly epic journey, you can extend your trip to cover the entirety of the Istrian coast, which Croatia shares with Italy and Slovenia. Number 8. The Netherlands Small in size, famously flat, and boasting painfully beautiful landscapes, the Netherlands is a great choice for any beginner to mid-level cyclist or group of cyclists looking to embark on their first multi-day bike trip. Cycling is hugely popular in the Netherlands, both within the cities and cross-country, so there's plenty of infrastructure to support the activity. It's also a very safe place to go biking, as the locals are accustomed to sharing the road. With bike paths snaking all across the country, it's easy to find a route to match every interest or comfort level. Maastricht to Amsterdam is a popular route that takes about six days. Cyclists seeking a major sense of accomplishment, however, may want to attempt biking the entire country from east to west or north to south. Number 7. Tawan Cycle Trail, Austria if you like awe-inspiring sights and you're not afraid of some challenging inclines, this may just be the trip for you. The core trail is only about 150 miles long, so there are perhaps some extreme ultra-distance cyclists who might be tempted to conquer it in a single day. Such an approach is a missed opportunity, however, as this is a breathtaking route with a whole lot to see and do along the way. The trail carries you through Hohe Tauern National Park, ice caves, the Kreml Waterfall, and Gross Glockner Mountain. Much of your ride is actually spent following the National Park's namesake river, the mighty Hohe Tauern. Along the way, you pass through the historic fairy tale city of Salzburg, where you'll surely want to spend a few days before continuing. Ambitious riders can test themselves by continuing all the way to Passau. Number 6. Via Francigena, Italy Beginning along the Swiss border at the Great St. Bernard Pass, Via Francigena is actually Italy's longest official cycling route. It ends, in suitably epic fashion, at the steps of St. Peter's Basilica in the holy city of Rome. One of the key highlights of this route are the rolling green and golden hills of Tuscany and the many historic farmhouses you'll see along the way. Tuscany's beauty lives up to the reputation and is arguably at its best when seen from a bicycle, the breeze against your skin and the landscape changing before your very eyes. That being said, the journey is stunning from start to finish. At 620 miles, however, it's not necessarily an easy trip. You're actually following in the footsteps of pilgrims dating back over a thousand years, so at least you're in good company. Number 5. Lake Constance, Germany, Austria, and Switzerland Though this cycling path is only 168 miles long, it carries you through three different countries. A popular cycling loop for groups of friends, 
The tour of Lake Constance naturally offers plenty of scenic views of the lake, as well as opportunities to spend time by the water and take a dip. As it winds further inland, however, it equally takes you alongside quiet forested areas, pastoral farmland, vineyards, historic churches, and a number of charming villages and towns, including Lindau and Meersburg. Tackling the trip at a comfortable pace that allows you to enjoy all the sights, the journey typically takes roughly five or six days. We recommend traveling in a clockwise direction in order to stay closest to the water. Number 4. Catalonia, Spain Though officially part of Spain, Catalonia has its own distinct culture and identity that sets it apart from the rest of the country. Catalonia as a whole offers many unique cycling opportunities, but Girona in particular has become something of a European mecca for cyclists. Located in southeastern Catalonia and extending to the coast, Girona is both the name of the city and the province. The city of Girona is beautiful and historic to the point that avid cyclists may find themselves tempted to relocate there permanently. It serves as a great home base for the endless cycling that can be done in the surrounding area. With plenty of flat stretches of road to cruise along in the valley, hilly terrain, and the nearby Roca Coroba mountain, Girona has a bit of everything to satisfy all skill levels and different types of cycling. Number 3. The French Alps Given that this is perhaps the most famous cycling destination on our list today, you may be wondering why we put it in third place rather than first. Quite simply, this particular cycling trip isn't for everyone. If you and your buds are beginners or intermediate cyclists, you should probably stick with something a bit more leisurely. The French Alps are for experienced cyclists who, if not professional, have dedicated a lot of time and energy to get into top shape. If you and your friends are out cycling early every morning and consider yourselves to be avid cyclists, however, this is the trip you've been training for. What better way to test yourself than to tackle the Tour de France climb of Col de Jouplan? There are numerous routes to choose from when cycling the French Alps, but the one constant is the astounding scenery. Number 2. The Peak District, United Kingdom UK residents are spoiled for choice when it comes to cycling routes. The countryside offers many scenic journeys. For example, a leisurely bike ride through the Cotswolds is a great way to spend a long weekend. Even against steep competition, however, Britain's Peak District stands out as being arguably the nation's most ruggedly beautiful, bike-friendly destination. The Peak District, despite the name, doesn't have many sharp peaks, but rather rolling hills, gorges, and valleys. And yet, the routes themselves aren't actually that challenging, making this a doable trip for families and groups that include relative newcomers to the world of cycling. There are dozens of routes to choose from, some of which stay on main roads, while others venture onto gravel paths or even incorporate some mountain biking. For those looking for the best overall experience and a moderate challenge, try the 160-mile Tour de Peak District. Number 1. Danube Cycle Path This is it, the bike trip by which all others are judged. The famous Danube Cycle Path follows its namesake river through 10 different countries for a staggering 1,770 miles. While the distance might seem intimidating, by approaching it from a downstream direction, you can actually make it a fairly leisurely ride, setting your own pace. Also, most people don't do the whole thing, instead picking convenient points along the way to start and stop, depending on what they want to see. However you choose to tackle it, the Danube cycle path is sure to make for an unforgettable bike trip. Of course, if you and your friends are looking for an epic months-long journey, you can tackle the entire Danube cycle path and extend it to include the larger Eurovelo 6 cycling route, which adds the Loire River for a 2,270-mile journey. Do you agree with our picks? Check out this other recent clip from Mojo Travels, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.